Hi guys, this is a really impromptu video because I wanted to hop on here because you guys know I've been really trying to clean and organize and just get rid of things that I am not using. And because we love handbags, I just been accumulating a lot of things I realized I haven't really been gravitating towards because I just haven't been using them or maybe I've gotten, I've had too many bags that are kind of similar. Um, so for that, I wanted to hop on here really quickly and just do a quick block sale. So these are the bags that uh, I'm like, some of them I absolutely still love, but I have something similar to it already. So therefore I wanna find new homes. So if you guys are interested in any of these bags, please DM me, I'll drop my information below. And then yeah, and let's get started. First bag is, First one is, and it comes with this dust bag right here, and it is the Louis Vuitton. Oh, what is this one called? I can't remember the name. Okay, I'm gonna drop everything below, but you guys can see this one's been in my collection for a while, but I really, really never use it that much. I mean, for the age of this bag, you can see that the, the uh, patina on the Vaquetta is actually perfect it's like this nice honey light honey color um there's absolutely nothing wrong the canvas looks amazing bottom is basically brand new i always store my bags stuffed so it does not lose its shape i use airbags and everything but yeah it comes in a class like this they don't even make this one anymore um i don't know if this would be considered vintage but I don't think it's vintage, but it definitely they don't make it anymore. The new ones don't have this um, gold loop on it right here. So you can see that there's no scratches and look at the stitching, absolutely perfect. Inside looks just like this. There is an inner pocket and, oh, here we go. This is the, delightful PM. Still has its tag. Still has its tag. So you guys can see it's basically new. Um, again, all these bags are purchased by me. So it's not, I didn't buy these secondhand or anything. So they're in great condition because I like to keep all my stuff in pristine condition. So if you guys are interested in this one, it's like this on your shoulder, super cute. This is great for like work or grab and go when it comes to you just wanna carry a little bit more. So yeah, this one is that. And again, I'll come in the original dust bag. Okay, second one, let's do a wallet. This one also is in this original box. I got this um, from Barney's and this was like a while ago. I think I wanna say like 2000. 2012, 2013 is when I got this, when Barney's was still around. Um, and that is this front right here. It's the Alexander Wang wallet and it's in this nice pebbled leather, gold hardware. You can see barely any scratches. I mean, a little hairline scratches here, but not a lot. I never really used it that much. Still has its original tag, care card authentication card everything inside and even have the barney's tag and this is the box it actually came in and the wallet holds so much and i love this one because it holds so much and it's still pretty small like you can see it's probably um smaller than like a full trifold wallet but you open it like this it's made out of leather there are some scratches on here but because it's smooth leather you can't really i mean you really don't notice it it looks worse on camera of in a person it's not that bad it's like this you have cards you can put back here cards you can put back here another more card slots you can put stuff in there and then there's a middle compartment where you can drop your coins and then there's this over here too and again here is a tag because i barely use this wallet i think i used it for like a month and that was it because i ended up getting a louis vuitton wallet and then just forgot about this so again, why am I getting rid of it? I just have, you know, I want to downsize. I want to make room for new things and things I'm currently using. And I want to find, you know, these are really good stuff. So I want to find good homes for everything. So yeah, this one is the wallet. Um, 
list that below. Okay, so to go with the wallet, I have this right here. Comes in this dust bag right here. This actually goes with the wallet. It's another Alexander Wang piece, and this one's in the, it's called the Prism Tote. So you can see it matches the wallet perfectly. Gold hardware on the bottom. This is also a really nice coated pebble leather, but super squishy and soft, and it has these really thin um, shoulder straps. So it really has that like minimalistic look. And this is great because if you don't want to have like a monogram item or you want something a little bit low key, this is great for traveling. This is great for a bunch of things. Now I purchased this because I looked everywhere and they don't make this bag anymore. This one is brand new, only used it. Actually, I don't even think I used it because I actually forgot about it. I just wanted the gold hardware. I went through this phase where I needed gold rose gold hardware and everything and anything so when i found this back i'm like yes rose gold um but the problem was i was always using my Neverfull that i just really never got around because i wasn't really into like leather and things like that back then so for that reason um i just forgot about this bag and a few months ago when i was actually cleaning i realized that this was still in my collection. I'm like, you know what? I need to find a better home for it because now I don't even use totes because you guys know I use small bags. So yes, let me know if you're interested. But again, I stuff it to make sure that everything maintains its shape. The inside's super cute. It has this right here. It has two um, pockets right here so you can stick your phone, keys, whatever it is. And the best part of this bag is it comes with this little zip pouch too also in the nice pebble leather rose gold hardware um and this does not detach though it's in in this like nice screw the zipper is buttery smooth and it still has its price tag as well because i really just never use the bag too much but yeah this is the prism tote and it matches the wallet so if you guys are interested in that let me know they're going to be sold separately but if you guys want to get both i can um put a bundle together for you guys okay next one you guys are going to be a little surprised because it's my pillow coach tabby and i know i just made a video on this and i mentioned that last video Ah, oh, like i don't know because i love it and it's sold out everywhere now especially in this color so I can't even like get it if I change my mind later, but it's just, you know, I did buy something else and you guys will see. And it really is exactly like this, but a different brand, a different pattern. So I'm like, I don't want two. I just can't justify two of the same type of bags. Um, and then because I have limited space, I really just didn't want to kind of have that. So again, like if nobody wants it, I'm totally fine because this is out of everything I've shared today. This is the one that I'm having a hard time letting go of because you guys, I told you, I just like love like squeezing it. So again, never use, still has its original tag. I did fill it up with stuff because I just did a video on it because I want to show you what it fits inside. But again, it still has its original tag, all the stickers. Now this strap doesn't come with a bag. This is from my coach um 19 and i just put it on there to show you guys but you guys can see i'll drop the video i made yesterday below but you'll see it comes in the shoulder strap also comes with the handle strap so that will come in a set i sell the original dust bag and everything okay. so i'm not gonna go through too much details of this because i did make that video yesterday so check it out below um and it does have the original hang tag on it still this little pillowy hang tag um and yeah brand new condition not one single scratch if you guys are interested in any of these bags i want to see more photos of it up close and in detail just to make sure you can check the condition of everything let me know um and then yeah dm me on instagram uh, something latte i'll drop it below but yeah so we can um i can give you more details on okay like we're nearly coming to an i don't have that many bags um, necessarily to sell i just wanted to clear some of the other stuff out they're like more low-key bags but i have this one right here this one i actually bought when i was in japan and it's really cool because it was like through a boutique and it's actually handmade real leather i believe it's real leather they told me it was real leather. It feels like real leather, but let me show you what it looks like. And it's really cool because it kind of 
like is great for traveling. Here is the brand right here. But yeah, it's in this forest green zippered. And then the inside just looks like that. And it's not long enough. I guess you could do a crossbody on it too, but it'll be a little bit high up. So I don't know if, you know, depending on where you like your backs to sit. And then this one is like in this Croco leather in white. And again, it looks like this. And then what's really cool about this is you can actually just snap it together to make, you can use them together, use them separate, but it looks like this. And I just wear it like this normally, but yeah, like this is um, super cute and unique. You definitely will not see. I just loved it because I did pick it up at a boutique. Um, but again, I just haven't used it in so long. So if you guys are interested, here is this one. Next bag is this one, and this one is super cute. I liked it because it, I thought it was fun. It's in these little patches. This is in vegan leather. This is actually a Zara bag. So again, I keep it stuffed, with stuff like this. And it has two sides like this into one pouch, and it does have crossbody strap as well. It has these gold clasps here. And also it has adjustable. So it's really cute. Like if you're going to an amusement park, you just want something fun and you don't want anything, um, you know, like expensive, something you have to worry about. This is a great vegan piece and it's just super fun. Has feet on the bottom as well and a little top handle. And yeah, this is from Zara. And this one I actually got at a pop-up shop um, that Re Rebecca Minkoff did um, when I was, this is like, I don't remember exactly where it was, but it's a little clutch. And again, I never used it because I bought it and I forgot about it. But yeah, it's, I liked it because it's in a pop of color, but you can just like wear it like this when you go out and it's in this really nice buttery leather. And then this is in an orange color. So it's like neutral mixed with a pop. Opens up like this. Like I said, I've actually never even used it. Here is the tag, the original price that I paid, plus this. Um, even has, you know, the care card inside. But yeah, super cute. It looks like this. It has their, you know, Rebecca Minkoff lining with card slots over here. And then a kiss lock section here that opens up, you can put like anything in here. It actually fits a lot for a clutch, but yeah, it just looks like that. And then the back has a little tag here and this is magnet, so really easy to open and close. So yeah, brand new Re Rebecca Minkoff clutch. And it comes in its original dust bag as well. Okay. And if you guys do buy that Louis Vuitton, I actually have the original Louis Vuitton bag that that bag came with as well. So if you guys want the entire set, let me know and this will come with that too. So that's it, you guys. I don't have that many things in the sale, but again, um, I don't mind keeping these because I still think that there's room for me to use them, but I really need to get out of the mindset that if I'm not having used it in the last like year or so, really probably just it's better for me to find a home where someone else will use it because I don't want to waste things you yeah, know that's it guys really like kind of just wanted to hop on here and just do a quick video with you guys again if you guys are interested in any of these or you have any questions always feel free to dm me or comment below just let me know and I'm happy to send you um, more photos or anything like that so again thank you so much for tuning in and watching and I will see you guys later bye